Hello, I'm Molly. You may remember me from such games as War Thunder, uh, Minecraft, and um, that's about it. Anyway, this Starbound, a couple of the other boys who make vids have put me onto it, so I thought, you know, I'll give it a go, might record a bit of it. At the moment, I'm Birdman. Called, and this was a randomly generated name, Meat Eyes. I'll just let you think about that for a minute. <clears throat> anyway. This is me planet, Alpha Vixarius 532. I'm the Birdman of Alpha Vixarius 532. This is my little gaff. It's also where I was strip mining, so I've dug it out quite extensively. Let's have a little wander down, just to show you the place. There's nothing here, much. Just strip mine. So what I've been doing, I've got myself a furnace, there. Of which I'm smelting copper bar. Smelted copper bar. A work table, where you can do what the hell you want on as well. Oh, well, that's right. Tables, chairs, etc. I don't know why I, what, what I need a yarn spinner for. Oh yeah, it's made leather armour. And bandages. Which I've got a load of at the moment. So let's have a little look at them. 40 bandages to look like shh, toilet roll. But, right, let's have a little kip in my bed. Just like that. Gets your health back up, you see. Right. In fact, I might take my bed with us. Or when I'm out on a mission. So, like I say, I'm not going to put you through building the first bit. I built a bit of a roof on here and a little bit of a door, but I've had to knock it down because I couldn't jump over it. We're going to have a little explore through the planet with spear and bow. We've got a bit of food, but not much. So, we could maybe... I know he's friendly, but... Shoot him anyway. Ooh, you dirty bastard. Have some of that. Aha! Eat it. Right. So we'll wander on a bit. There's mines down. I've got me bit torch. I've been down a few of them, but not that many. Oh, anything down here? I can't remember if I've dug down here, but we'll have a little shuft anyway. Hmm. Gone a bit dark. Right few lights so I can take some of these bit Tarzan vine things down and I can use them when I get back to make me bandages at the moment I'm on I'm on the lookout for that elusive iron and oh, there's no at the bottom of this just water a lot of water Drowning amounts of water, probably. So let's be back out of there. Is that coal? Or is it iron? I need iron wherever I see it. So, out we go. Oh, oh yeah. Right. A torch. See if I can get out of here. Ha! Get on that. Yep, cockatiel's head with a very s silly pair of goggles on. Oh, someone's online on Skype and it's flashed up on this. Sod off. Oh well, I'll have to stay. Oh. Crocodile creatures and they're killing me. I've oh, got one of them. Let's have a bandage before we die. You eat your bandages. And another. That sorted us. Oh god, their attacks kick your ass. Fuck off. 
Arsehole. I'll have the meat off you, you bastard. Right, was there anything down there we could see, or was it just water? Just water again, I think. Stick a torch down, see if we can see any. Oh, looks like copper. Let's be having the copper. Always need copper. I'm more desperate for iron. So the whole idea of the first part of this game is that you're marooned on a planet and you've got to build, essentially do up challenges that lead to building a distress beacon <coughs> which invites a fucking boss down which at the moment will up my arse but never mind. But I've got to get enough iron to be able to build the beacon. I'm going to chop a tree or two down as well. And the trees fall. I like it. Uh oh. Die, you bastard. On your mate. Ha! Screw you, you arsehole. Right, another miney looking place. Let's have a little shuft. Oh! Shit! Haha! <laughs> Got you, you bastard. And I'm going to kill your mate as well. Get on that. There's nothing even down here, is there? Oh. A pod. Get some health. Get some light. Oh, is that coal? Right, I think it's coal. Just money. Right. I might get that coal while I'm here. If I don't drown first, that is. Copper as well. Iron I'm still looking for. Right. Right, got the copper, got the coal, still short of iron. Right, I mean we could try just sinking a shaft and see if there's anything hanging about. I don't think it's the kind of game that focuses too much on the mining side of things. I think it's more surface stuff, but I suppose the mining is part of it as well. Just flood this out, I think. Might get rid of the water if we can. Yeah, the water can all go down there. See if there's any minerals at the bottom of it. More coal. Yes, more coal. We always need coal. Get out. Right. Might as well get it while we're here. Well, like I said, it's iron I need. Doesn't seem to be a lot of it hanging about on this planet. Right. I think we'll leave this hole. Oh, uh, crocodiles. Ha! Right. Quickly take a bandage. What was his mate? Oh, iron. I see iron. In the bottom of this rock pool. Oh, it looks like silver as well. Is that silver? 
Yeah, silver. Right. Iron, that's what we need. Wasn't much of it there, but... Any more? No. Right. I hear something beastly. Oh, big cliff face. Right, shall we go down the mine? Yes, we shall. Copper. Crocodile blocks. So, stab them, I think. Ah. Oh, they're gonna kill us, they're gonna kill us. Right. Fuck off, little bastard. Get the sweet, sweet crocodile meat off him. Right. Dig down. About to be goodies down here. this that's iron oh crocodiles don't kill me have that you bastard ha right quickly mine this iron out is that it for iron Iron. Get a bandage. We'll do it on the run. Any more iron? It's copper. No, I'll leave the copper for now. All we want is iron. Iron or coal? I can't tell, so we'll have it anyway. Deep dark hole. Let's go down it. There's coal. Any iron? Iron! Iron! Crocodile people. Ha! Right, so what shall we do? I think we may have to get that copper. like a maniac. Right. Anything up there, do you think? Let's have a look. Ooh, more minerals. Aha! I see iron. In we go. Right, we'll take that. that. We'll nick some coal. 
Then we'll head back to base camp in a cheaty sort of way. Oh, more there. Right. Plenty of copper. Uh oh, green dude. Green dude. Stab. Stabby. Ha. Stab you, you green twat. Right, let's get some copper. Bastard. Ah, yeah, got ya. Right. Oh, shit. This is, could be the end of me, this. It's alright, you don't lose your gear, just your coinage. So. Oh, no, can't, I'm not going to survive that one. Let's get out of here. Shit. Beam me up, beam me up, Scotty. There we go. So now. I'll be back near me gaff. If you can call it a gaff. Shut the door, but there isn't a door on that side, so we'll quickly make a door. 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 Ta. Craft that door. It's getting dark. It's getting dark, and there are wolves after me again. The less like wolves, and more like crocodiles. So, there's the door on it. And you can actually freeze to death on this game, which is quite interesting. Adds another le level of realism to it. So let's just pop this on there. There. <laughs> Does anyone do that in real life, or is that just cartoons? Does anyone whistle while they snore? I've never heard anyone do it. Answers on a postcard, please. So that's a nice, just a quick start adventure into the wilderness a bit, trying to find more iron. I don't know why I'm sleeping and not smelting the iron while I'm doing it. Well, fuck it, we'll smelt the copper first, because I like copper. Leave that a smelt. You've got to tell it to smelt. Smelt. And then I'll kip a bit. Uh, what have I got? I've got my bone out, hunting bow. So if you hunt the animals and the friendly animals, or the well, or the ones, the malignant animals as well, you get meat and leather off them, leather to build the armour, meat to eat. Trees come down fairly easy with the axe, the stone axe. That's your bandages. What else have I got? I've got a little bit of wheat. So you can plant, obviously you can farm as well. I've got silver. I've got, what's that? Oh wait, you can grow more stuff. I've got a broken phoenix sword. I've got some stairs I was using. I've got petals, don't know what they're for. Probably to make them dies. I've got a thousand dirt blocks. I've got alien meat. I'll probably have to eat some of that in a bit. <laughs> now I have to cook it first. And cooked alien meat, cobblestone. That's all the shit I've been digging out. That's me copper bars. Me iron, me iron ore, 17. Iron ore is rarer you, by the looks of it. So let's have me copper bars back. And let's put me steel in. What I need to build is the distressed beacon. There. Oh, you need silver bar as well. Well, I've got silver a little bit. So, I smelt me silver. I don't know how much silver I've got. Two. That might not be enough. Got plenty of plant fibre. I can probably make some bandages out of that. 
and in. I'll have to type it in. Bandages. Takes it back up a bit. What else can I make on this? Tills wise. Iron hunting bow. No, I don't want to make one of them next. I haven't got platinum. Gold. Or copper. Oh no, I've got enough. Right. Tools. Weapons. It's a pegger. A carver XL. Sword. Tomahawk. The hatching. A hatchling, I've got that. I've already got that there. Right, so that should be done. Eight iron bars. Cool. Right. Silver. That. I need to be getting more silver as well then. Anyway, that was just my brief introduction to the game. Like I say, it's still in its beta form at the moment. It's very, very, a very, very good beta. It's definitely worth the money. Go out, buy it, play it, love it. It's got, what, how many were Four or five on it. Lizard race, fish race, human race, bird race, and monkey race. Well, Ape Apex, they call them. Which is quite fun, because a lot of the planets have got different bits and bobs on them. They've got, like you say, me and Max and Gibby went and rumbled out a monkey research facility. And they all were all armed to the teeth with guns, but we rumbled in, rocked up. Smash the doors down, in we go, nick everything that's nickable. Kill everyone that's killable. Anyway, thanks again for watching. I'll pop this out, and I hope you enjoy it. And I'll be putting more War Thunder stuff out as usual. And like I say, I'm going to start upping the output again a bit. After a few busy weeks that I've had, when I haven't had much chance to put something out. And I hope you keep on watching. Thanks for your support. And like I say, go and watch Gibby stuff as well. He's more, he's well into this already. He's he's doing videos. I'll link you up to some of them probably on the end of this. And Max and his world of tanks and his Minecraft and everything else that he does. Watch them both. Right. Anyway, thanks very much for watching and goodbye.